Hey guys, so I know I can't be just making silly videos of myself singing like Beatles songs. So today's front I will play a lesson is uh, about everyday one everyday word phrase you can use in Japanese, which is not this itself, but right, it's a verb like you use with microwave. Oh, please microwave it <coughs> and eat it. So. How to say a phrase like microwave it in Japanese? So first of all, very first of all, what is microwave in Japanese? It is this, with kanji and with katakana. Den shi renji. Den shi renji. For those who can't, who can't get what I'm saying, I'm writing. Uh, Okurigana. Denshi with hiragana. Denshi. So literally, this means things like the literal meaning is electronics or electron. So electron and she means children, child, or something that small. But not with this kanji, I'm sorry. But yeah, microwave and lenji. I don't know what Renji is, but Renji... Anyway, we call microwave Denshi Renji in Japanese, or sometimes, or most of the time, we just say... Sometimes, yeah, sometimes we just say Renji. Renji. But, yeah, Denshi Renji. But when you are, for example, in, uh, in an electronic store, you'd say you are looking for Denshi Renji. You wouldn't... I wouldn't say Renji. I'm looking for lunch. So, anyway, how to say microwave something? It's easy. Chinsuru. This is a. What? 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 Clock. It's a spoken word. It's not formal. This is not formal, but you can say chinsuru as a verb. So, if it's past, you can change this part, suru, to shita, like chin shita. And if you're asking somebody to microwave, to chin, <coughs> you can ask chin shite. Yeah. And a uh, formal way, or less casual way to say microwave. You know, the, mi the way you say microwave is informal, you know. The formal way would be like, please heat it in the microwave or something. Heat it in the microwave, right? Yeah, the how to say something like that in Japanese is just blah 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 wave wave parties. Denshi renji. So denshi renji ni kakeru. Denshi renji ni kakeru. So this part, if you're asking somebody, somebody else to put something in the microwave. Asking. So, this kind of way of verb is, can be seen with another phrase too. Hini kakeru. This kanji, kanji means fire or flame. Fire, fire. Small fire. So, hini kakeru means something like you, are, you, have, you, have, you have a pan. And put it on a fire. You don't say fire it like it's shooting. Open fire! And this is kind of what I thought would be typical uh, ad on a <coughs> frozen food package. Lenji de kantan, chinsu dake. Lenji de kantan, chinsu dake. It's like easy to cook. Just microwave with a microwave. Yeah, just easy to cook. Just microwave. Lenji de kantan. Chinsu dake. Got it? Yeah. Oh, look. Right, I th yeah. I don't know if you know, if you already knew this. But this would be useful to know. Chinsuru. Easy? 
Qing. But why this is Qing? If you have a good idea, I think you know it. It's an onomatopoetic, onomatopoeia word. Like when, at least in Japan, most microwaves have the sound Qing when it and when it finishes microwaving. So it's yeah, we took we took it after that. So Qing Qing suru. Yeah, that's it. I hope you understood my lesson today. Thanks for watching. Yeah, and as my lesson is finished today, ching. that's another chin or chin chin. Yeah, got my joke. Yeah, thanks for watching. Bye.